Now, meteorologist Eric Johnson with the Idaho News 6 forecast. We had a hot weekend and a mild Monday, but our temperatures are cooling off by about 10 degrees today, putting us into the upper 70s. So it's going to be a really pleasant day with our temperatures, although we will see some cloud cover moving in and out of the area throughout the afternoon. And then as we move into the end of the week, we're actually going to continue to cool those temperatures off. So feeling more like fall as we are heading through the last couple of days of summer. And then as we do start fall on Saturday, we're actually looking at a really spectacular weekend with lots of sunshine and warmer temperatures. And that may have you thinking about heading up into higher elevations to look at some of the fall foliage. Right now, we're still seeing lower color uh, up in the central mountains as we move through the next week or so. We're expecting a lot of those leaves to start uh, changing, especially up into the Wood River Valley. and up into the Stanley area as well. So that peak for the Treasure Valley, we're still a ways away from that. The second to third week of October is when we'll really start to see our peak color here in the Treasure Valley. But again, really starting to feel more like fall over the next couple of days with this low pressure system diving to the south out of Western Canada. And that's gonna be with us for a couple of days. As we head into your Thursday, it will be moving into eastern Oregon, so we'll see a lot of showers, especially down into the Magic Valley. You can see a lot of that missing us here in the Treasure Valley, so we actually may stay mostly dry. But as we move into Thursday night and Friday morning, some of those light showers beginning to develop for us in the Treasure Valley. So just timing out that rain looks like we stay dry for your, wen uh, for your Wednesday across the Treasure Valley. A few showers and storms possible down in the Magic Valley. And then Thursday, we do have a slight risk, about a 20 to 30% chance here in the Treasure Valley, but those chances do increase as you head further to the east. Also, uh, more numerous showers into the Magic Valley. And then I think it's really overnight Thursday into Friday when we have our best chance for the Treasure Valley, waking up to some scattered showers as well. And we'll see a lot of that activity continuing for our higher elevations. Now those temperatures again are going to continue to cool each day. Average highs are in the upper 70s will be well below that into the middle of the week down to 71 on Wednesday. Lots of sunshine though and then that chance for some showers Thursday into Friday. We'll see more cloud cover around and very cool temperatures only topping out in the 60s and we'll have a brisk northwest breeze. So it's going to feel a little bit chilly throughout the day. These are the coolest temperatures we've seen since late June. And then into this weekend, as we do kick off fall on Saturday, we are warming those temperatures back up, making way for a gorgeous weekend. And the Magic Valley, a very cool end to the week. Highs only getting into the upper 50s and lots of showers around, but a really fantastic weekend with those temperatures warming back up.